Good morning. So I am getting ready to head down to Waterloo. I think I'm going to hook up the boat and go out fishing for a little bit. It's kind of hit and miss as far as the weather. It looks like it's going to rain, then it turns sunny for a little bit, then it gets cloudy, then it looks like it's going to rain again. Um, but we're going to go out this morning and see if we can catch anything. shown you guys yet was I got my mystery tackle box in the mail yesterday and it ended up being the bat or no the bluegill and panfish one so I'm gonna show you what is in it quick well I'm floating around out here waiting for Brian to come but we're gonna, I'm gonna show you what's in there quick and try not to get in any accidents here so let's check it out so it looks like we got a flat fish little gold Trolling type deal. We got an invader. Nice little jig. That might actually work for bass or walleye even. Got some little pink tail looking things. And we got some, I don't know what these are. Hoggy hog. Playfish, pumpkin color. They also got some little hooks to throw out. So total it looks not bad.
Hey everybody, so I just got back from Waterloo. Ended up going out fishing for a little bit longer than what I thought I was going to. I thought I was only gonna go out for a couple hours, but I met up with Brian and he joined me and we putzed around the lake for a while. Couldn't find anything. We were just kinda, you know, it was just great. Talking, enjoying it, dodging a couple of rainstorms and having a great time. We ended up, I ended up taking pictures before he came and having fun doing that. I enjoy taking pictures, especially with wildlife and birds. Found a mess of pelicans that have been staying down that way. And it was fun to take a picture of them and see them and just be able to watch them. They're very graceful creatures and very cool to watch. Um, while me and him were out, we found one that was having some issues. Had some fishing line and a lure trapping its legs together behind its back or behind its kind of butt so it can't really swim. It can't fly very well. And we tried everything in our power to get close enough to grab it. And a couple times it took off and flew. We enlisted the help of a couple professionals. Um, one wasn't able to get down in the time frame. And the other one stopped out with a net. And by that time, we don't know where the pelican head went. So we're probably, I'm gonna probably try again tomorrow and see if we can catch it. Um, I can't stand to see birds suffer like that. Unfortunately, that eagle that I told you guys about last vlog and why I'm getting away from lead stuff, um, it ended up passing away a couple, yeah, a couple days ago now, like yesterday. Um, was doing better, but then started deteriorating again. Just a little bit too high of a lead content, I guess. And um, With that, I did order the stuff that I'm gonna look at trying some alternative metals to pour my own jigs to see what type of quality I can do and how well they turn out. So that stuff's ordered. I've been working on some stuff for Waverly Heritage Days. That's getting exciting. That's getting really darn close. Only a few months away. And Easter dinner is tomorrow. So I'm gonna go visit the family with that. I'm probably gonna take the boat out for at least a little bit and go around that lake a couple times, see if I can find that pelican before he tries migrating and maybe losing legs. I don't know how bad it is, but um, I'm gonna try helping him out and see if I can find him tomorrow. So you guys might see some video on that depending on how things go. We'll check it out, we'll see how it goes. But if I don't see you guys tomorrow, I hope you guys have a great Easter. Uh, special thank you to Marshall for shouting me out on his channel. He's a great guy. He does some um, a lot of a Sunday shout out. He shouts out 10 names of YouTube channels trying to help them get publicity. He's a great guy. I really appreciate his shout out and him checking out the videos. Thank you, Marshall. Um, and I'm talking with another YouTuber a little bit about possibly doing a collab. I don't know if that's going to work out or not. We'll see what the river rat says and see what we can figure out. A couple different channels, you know, his is more weight building or weightlifting and vlogging and mine's fishing and we'll see. It's not out of the realm of possibility. We're kind of loosely talking about it. So we'll see what happens with that. But I hope you guys have a great day. Have a good Easter. And we'll catch you guys later. Keep your lines tight. Remember, I can. And keep on fishing. Have a good one. Thanks for watching. Hope you guys um, subscribe. Like it if you... If you liked it, comment down below on what's your favorite bird to watch or take pictures of or do whatever. What's your favorite bird to watch? And share it with your friends if you enjoyed it. Have a good one, guys.